a Glasgow mum fears she will be confined to a wheelchair for the rest of her life if she cannot afford vital stem cell treatment abroad. Sinead Kirtland is desperately trying to raise thousands of pounds to travel to Mexico after being diagnosed with multiple sclerosis in 2015. The 48-year-old, originally from Dublin but has lived in the city for 25 years, was first misdiagnosed with carpal tunnel syndrome. But her family were dealt a devastating blow when Sinead fell poorly four years ago. She was taken to the Royal Alexandra Hospital in Paisley where she was diagnosed with the illness. Multiple sclerosis, or MS, is a lifelong condition that affects the brain and spinal cord, and is the number one cause of disability in younger adults. To make matters worse, the mum of one was later diagnosed with progressive relapsing MS, meaning she is in a steadily worsening state with acute relapses but no remissions. When I was admitted to the RA in November that year I had no idea MS was or what it would mean for me, Sinead told the Evening Times. I was very much in the opinion that I could continue as normal, but the reality is that's far from the truth. There has been a progression of things getting worse, and this year things rapidly declined. I fear that if nothing is done I will be in a wheelchair within a year or so. My mobility has been majorly reduced, getting around is very hard. I have to stop with fatigue and tiredness, my legs just don't work like they used to. A GoFundMe fundraising page has been set up to help cover costs for Sinead to get chemotherapy with stem cell treatment in Mexico. Around £13,000 has been raised so far, with the aim to raise around £40,000. While there is no cure for MS, it's hoped the treatment will stop things getting worse. Sinead says that despite treatment trials in the UK, there is little chance they will be available to her for a few years. She added, so I have no other choice, I either have to raise the money and try the treatment in Mexico, or just accept that I will be confined to a wheelchair and continue to get worse. Sinead has praised her amazing 11-year-old daughter Erin for helping her get through the illness. She added, I have little use left in my right hand, so my husband Fraser has been a massive support, he always cooks the meals and works around the house. He's been a massive emotional support through it all. Commenting on the success of the fundraiser so far, she added, the response has been amazing. My family in Ireland and people over here too have just been so great. I never believed it would do so well but I'm so grateful that it is. It's very humbling. You can view the fundraiser at here. For more on this story, visit the news article link.